What's up everyone, Viper here with a little Wednesday, uh, I don't know what you call it yet, gotta figure it out. Uh, every now and then, like I went live before, did a ride along with Viper uh, when I was coming back from a call. Uh, there's a video I have out from last year when I first started my channel between, I don't know, February, maybe May or wherever. There's a short video where, we, where me and Boss and I had to upright a trailer because the wind blew it over. So if you guys want to check that out, you can check that one out too. It's a short, real short video. So sometimes I make short videos. Last week we had a call we went out on uh, for a flatbed trailer. It's a spread axle, and this is what's missing right there. As you can see, the wheel's missing. So yeah, broke it, broke the wheel right off the axle there, right off the axle, clean off the axle there. See, that's what it's supposed to look like right there. It's supposed to have a wheel right there, right? Well, this one, it's not clean off. How do they do that? Well, there's an exit down there at a place that drivers actually hit quite a bit of time uh, that we uh, we do a lot of subframe work, placing subframes because they hit this big round yellow concrete barrier. Now there is some weeds in front of it and stuff, but when you're going out the exit, if, you know, I just I don't think anybody pays attention to it. So they make the turn when they, it's an S turn kind of, when they bear it, when they go left and they got to go right around it, they don't follow the roadway. There's plenty of roadway to follow a wide and around towards the right well they cut it too close and that's what can happen either you're going to bend a subframe underneath the trailer or you got and this is the first time i've seen this snap a wheel right off the axle and that's what they did here snap the wheel right off the axle there so yeah so that's that was last week there i just thought i'd show this do a quick video uh let you let you all see what kind of calls we get what kind of what kind of things we do um so uh, I'm thinking I might set myself up every now and then, uh, maybe do a road call and show, you know, and take, you know, a video of it on what's wrong with it and, you know, you know, how I fix it and stuff, you know, just a quick video or whatever, or maybe something unusual, but I got, I got to get set up for that, uh, because right now all I do is use my phone, uh, to take videos and do my scratch off, stuff like that. So every now and then I might do that, um. Uh, if I get set up, you know, get the stuff I need to do that. Uh, every now and then, when, if I go out on a road call, I'm out in the parking lot, i got to fix a trailer, I'm the only one there. You know, maybe show you, you know, what's wrong with it, and do a quick video on what I'm doing to fix the problem or whatever, you know, replacing the chamber or something like that. So let me, what, let me know what y'all think about it. And you're probably wondering, like, where's that wheel at? Well, here's the wheel right here. I got this truck next to it. I don't want to try to show the sign on that truck. But there's the wheel right there. It's on the flatbed. We had to go back. Boss and I had to go back. He had to bring the record this time. <coughs> Excuse me. And winch this thing out of the weeds because it was on the other side of the concrete barrier. And it's too heavy to try to do it ourselves. So we had to take the record out there, winch it out from around that big round bar yellow barrier, and um, put it in my service truck and bring it back. So, yeah. So anyway, so I just wanted to show you what what kind of you know what the call kind of calls we go out on, what we see. It's not every day you see something like that. Like I said, I've never came across. I've come across bent subframes that you know we chain up the axle, bring it back here. We are another subframe and so on, which I'll show you that in another video uh, later in the video, and uh, and just show you what this one looked like for now. So yeah, so that's gonna do it here. Like I said, I just wanted to show you what kind of stuff we, <laughs> we get into here. So, anyway, so I'll be doing my state-to-state -state battle uh, tonight when I get home. Uh, I've got my ticket already. Hoping to get something good. Uh, it's been a lot of fun with it. So, yeah. All right, so that's going to do it for now. So, uh, I'll see you all in the next one. And you all have a good day.